everybody. Uh, this is Kelly Dixon coming at you with episode 408 of the Breaking Bad Insider podcast. Uh, I'm here with Vince Gilligan, creator of the show. Hello. Here with uh, Dean Norris, plays Hank. Yo. And we got a special guest today. We got Stephen Bauer, who plays Don Eladio. Buenas. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Thanks for coming in, you guys. Thank you, Stephen. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. Well, you know, before we started this podcast, I was talking a little bit uh, to Dean about the different interpretations of your scene with the DEA guys and Detective Tim and Gomez, actually, right. and, and Giancarlo, bringing Giancarlo in for questioning. Um, you know, we, uh, I worked um, with Vince on the editing of this episode, and we had different interpretations also. And so I wanted to hear your story, Dean, about, uh, about how you guys interpreted that and the difference that you had, because you were saying you had a difference of a... Right, right. Was this also the this episode where Brian and I were in the car? Going to yes. chicken. Yes. 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 That was a big discussion on that day. Too. Oh, was there? Yeah. Oh, was there? And it's great to listen. It's great. It's one of the most fun things about the show to be on. You know, listen to uh, Brian Cranston give his take on certain things. You know, and here we had another moment in the yeah. car yeah. where we had some discussions about. Just, it really, we're talking like you know, mm -hmm. just levels. Like yeah, we're not yeah, talking yeah. fundamental dis disagreements. We're talking like freaking how much little spice here, yeah. how much little level here to, to add or to take out, and blah blah blah. It was a great conversation he had in the car when we pulled up to the to the chicken place where it, the question was when i say oh we're not going here for the chicken and, right. and brian was like you know where do you know if i'm am i here yeah i can't do it it's a podcast but he would put his hand at you know show my a level, level three the level or three or my level, level 10, 10 <laughs> you know and the question is do i start at level nine and go to 10 or do i start at level three and go to you know yeah. and it was a great discussion about yeah. you know and you see how how much of this stuff is is really put together, right? You know, and and you know he could do anything, and so we would do a couple other ones, you know, and he could yeah. just for the heck of it would would jam either any level you want, you know. What I'm That's saying? the wonderful oh, thing about editing, you guys too, is that you guys give us really, really get different performances and different nuance that's yeah. so perfect. That's true. You know, I mean, it's like... And that's not unintentional. I mean, sometimes we know that we're like, you know, we know that these guys are great in the editing room, so let's give them this and this and oh, this yeah. and let them and trust them to put options. it together oh, yeah. in, a, in, a, you know, options, yeah. in a way that... Uh, you oh, know. yeah, because... Oh, sorry, go ahead. Oh, I'm sorry, just that scene you speak of, it's, it's, I can imagine there was a quite a bit of discussion because it's tricky because you want the audience to see... We're thinking of this in the editing too. You want the audience to to witness to 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 feel Walt's discomfort, right? That during mm. the headlights thing, yeah. and yet if he gives you too much of that, then Hank is is kind of dense for not saying, "Hey, buddy, why well, are you so uncomfortable?" Right, but we were able to play it because I, from the beginning of the sh of the of this whole series, I always think he's kind of a dork, and I know yeah, he's yeah, getting yeah. nervous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we were able to play the Breaking Bad yes. comedy. I think. Yes. Oh, no, it, no, it's oh, a great totally scene because yeah. he, he's, he's like a great he's shit his pants. I'm thinking he shit his pants because he's trying to do. A, I'm getting yeah, yeah, yeah. it, so I'm trying to come on, guy. Yeah, let's yeah, get yeah. into this big yeah, thing. Yeah, you yeah, know, everyone. You think it's a macho thing, right? Everyone's playing their own little game there, and I think it. Hopefully, it worked. It works like both of those things. So, you know, I wanted to definitely talk about this scene, this last big scene in the show, because it's a huge departure from what we usually do. This is, we're basically giving background information. We don't even give background information on our main characters. Yeah, that's we, kind of true. We're giving a big background on this one. But I, You asked me earlier, you were, mm -hmm. we were talking about this, about walking into that scene. Do I know? I've already envisioned, as it allowed you. Yes. Have I already envisioned what's going to go down? Yeah. That there will be blood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so I'm looking at this kid. I'm meeting him for the first time. And, you know, and I already have my, my, my heart on for, for, for Gus. Yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah, 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 sure. But this guy is so hard. I, I'm like, I'm looking at him. I'm thinking, as cold as I am and as much, as much killing as I've done, done and had done. Yeah. Wow, this is gonna be tough. Yeah, 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 <laughs> you know, yeah, 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 yeah. it's gonna be tough. It's yeah. like I have to look at it like you know, just gotta. It's like a dog you've got to put down. Yeah, yeah. And, and that's what it was like. I was watching him do his thing, and he's so. The other thing about James is that he's so sincere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's Your so in, you know he's yeah. in the moment. He's yeah. it's, it's heartbreaking, and yeah, I'm just yeah. saying kid your life's about to be over yeah you know I, but for nothing I, yeah for nothing for yeah, nothing to teach a lesson to the to, other guy to, to, because to, of him to yeah make him suffer yeah right? yeah yeah have and to, to and to that end you guys don't torture he doesn't even see it coming it's, no, a, it's just it's over. done That's yeah. It. yeah yeah it's it's clean yeah yeah but it was really really tough and james was, was really well i was uh, i appreciated the work that he did 
on the on the uh, the technical uh, the stuff that he has to talk, you know yeah. the stuff that he talks about in the scene. Oh yeah, you know, it's in over Spanish, my head. Too. You know, <laughs> <laughs> it's over my real head. Mine too. <laughs> um, we'll just and a lot of you up. too. A lot of him like oh, just, uh, a lot of stuff you're talking about. You yeah, know, yeah, yeah. <laughs> get to the point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, that's I want to. Great scene. I want to mention too. I mean, you guys did allude to uh, Gus and Max being lovers. In that it's a very, very subtle you know, it's, illusion. It's, up to, it's open to interpretation. It's but it's whatever the audience wants it to. Yeah, be. because it, it and it's there. It's the there. It's there. I never I didn't I never heard anybody talk about that. Mm -hmm. But I thought I thought it was. It's kind definitely of there. in the script. I, I thought mean, it's it was there. kind of yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. And um, and that's okay to to yeah. to to, well, to infer that. The only reason that I bring that up is because for me, I mean, you've done something as as a as a production team. Writers, actors, everybody. You've done something for me, um, especially as an editor, uh, coming at this because it's you really have created an incredible drama around mm -hmm. a guy that I don't want to like. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. and what happens in that scene because. Um, everybody is so wonderful, but especially because of what you said about James Martinez, that he is so, mm. is, he's just so sweet, so and he's sweet, so, so sincere, and, so innocent. and it's yeah. like when he gets shot, you feel for him, but I really felt for God. I did too, yeah. and I did I'm too, like, How in I did too, I had to, again, I had yeah. to keep myself from really feeling anything, because I, I, right. I you know, I've got my bone, my thing for him, yeah. it's, it's, it's there, and at it's the there, end, the way he looks at him, and also the way he talks about him, yeah. to me, mm -hmm. the way he explains he's my partner he's my company you know. he's my boy you know. my compañero my yeah. you know it's just and so I'm sweet like, i'm like uh-huh mm -hmm. yeah 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 mm -hmm. really? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Really? <laughs> really oh you really care about this boy oh too bad yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. i'm really gonna hurt you <laughs> You're yeah. my this yeah. is really gonna hurt you i think i think don Aladio is a man who knows that uh, yeah. is killing someone is not not necessarily the worst thing you can do to him Exactly. I, I mentioned in the last podcast there was a moment in this episode where it's not what we intended, but it's so much better than what oh, we yeah, intended. Oh yeah, what is that? That's the moment where uh, James Martinez's character gets Max gets killed. I always pictured that you'd be on him as he's begging for his life, or begging not for his life, begging for, for Gus's for, for life. For Gus's life. And all of a sudden, you know, Tia would come into frame and <laughs> kill him. And instead, uh, I don't think. Um, uh, Johan, the wonderful director, even shot, even covered that moment. But the way he intended it and the way he cut it and the way we've kept it ever since, we never changed a frame of the way he cut that that bit there. Why? What is, 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 is that uh, at the moment that uh, Max's character dies, he's begging for his life, and in mid-sentence, you cut to Gus, and Gus is looking squarely at your character. Squarely at me, yeah, and I mean, I've got sudden, him. Yeah, yeah, all of a sudden you hear... Bam and There's blood, blood hits him. Hits oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That was done so. Yeah. It was done so well. It was and just so crucial. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was so crucial yeah. because he's really looking at me, and I'm watching him. Yeah. And I'm watching him, and he has no idea. He's literally looking at me like this, and you hear pop, mm -hmm. and it goes, and yeah. it hits him like this, yeah. and he goes, ah, yeah. oh, yeah. like that. It takes a moment. He's like, what oh. just happened? And then he realizes. Yeah, he starts James, shaking. Poor James, oh my god! And the kid did the way he fell over was amazing too. Now, how much leeway did he have to do that, to shoot it that way? How, how, much? how much leeway did, would Johan, for instance, have to shoot it that way? Because that seems like a pretty radically different way than... He, he, he the, covered the other way. He covered he the other way, and yeah. then also offered up this, this and it, way. And yeah. if you cover it the other way, then you then don't even have to you, tell me. Right. But, yeah. but right. he also talked me through it in the before they ever got there. He said, I'm thinking of doing it this, do it way. this way. And I said, let me think about that. And then I thought about it. I was like... You know what? That is pretty damn good. Yeah. But I mean, the, the truth is, uh, this is the old, old thing from the William Goldman novel about. Uh, uh, oh yeah. The William Goldman talking about writing uh, all the president's men, and mm -hmm. he'd say to Alan Pakula, "Do you want it this way or do you want it that way?" And Alan Pakula would say, "Don't rob me of any riches." Meaning, <laughs> meaning write it both ways. Yeah, exactly. Right, sure, so right. it's like uh, awesome. you know, uh, I'm 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 greedy for give it to me every which yeah, way. Yeah, man. But yeah. but there's no time to give it to you every which way. So right. that's what why we depend on these wonderful directors who have an eye. Yeah. Uh, like Michelle here, who who have a, a vision, and they, they give right. us uh, this great stuff. So. I guess we should uh, wrap this up. Thank you, Stephen. Thank you. Thank you, Dean. Thanks. Thanks, Vince. This thank was you. really fun. Pleasure, pleasure oh, having you guys. guys. Really pleasure really having you on this well, show. Thank man. you so People much. are going to shit when they see this. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> so uh, thanks, everybody, for listening, and let's go break bad. All right. All right. All right.